So, what is up guys, Killer Kevin today back with a brand new episode of Skyrim Remastered Showcases. Hopefully guys are having a super sick day, and today we are going to be looking at the Shattered Armor. I think I said that right, Shattered, Shattered, Shattered Air. I'm not too sure, but basically it is based off of Black Desert Online. I know that for a fact, because I actually had to look into this as well. And uh, by the screenshots via verification of the Bethesda Net net sorry and obviously the Google searches for the this armor actually in black desert they are almost identical they look absolutely beautiful not too sure what to expect from this personally though but I'm gonna go into it and have a little look so once you've installed the mod again links always down in the description make sure to go and click those and grab all of the necessary yeah you're gonna to need to go over to any forge now for me I'm in obviously white rum my favorite place obviously and you're gonna to need to go down into Daedric to create all of these pieces of armor you get the helmet the gauntlets and and obviously the boots so uh, let's go into this and start creating some stuff if you're wondering what armor I do wear throughout my videos uh, it changes but I do normally tell you this is actually a uh, not the rock uh, this was actually I think yesterday's episode uh, it's out on the channel go check it out uh, it is actually called haven't have all have all the rock great mod beautiful set of armor you get an absolutely overpowered weapon and shield as well it is based off the Dark Souls franchise but uh, yeah, let's crack onto this one. So we're going to need to go into a Diedrich, and we're going to need to find this one as well. And obviously it is here. Holy smokes, it looks beautiful. Cannot wait. The boots, the gauntlets, and the helm. Oh my god, that looks absolutely beautiful. Now, a lot of people have had a lot of problems on the forums here, so I'm not too sure how it's going to go. But a lot of people are saying that it always crashes. All the textures, when they put it on, do go invisible. Uh, any chance of this going on PS4? Uh, some people are like really great job really expect it thanks for fixing and re-uploading it a lot of people are like yeah it looks beautiful and looks fine um, so I'm not too sure a lot of people have a lot of problems hopefully I don't for this showcase and hopefully you don't as well so again what to expect from this armor three leather straps two leather gold ingot and four ebony ingots this is obviously going to be quite pricey for the chest but then again you are getting a super set of armor boots as well three leather gold ingot and ebony ingots this seems to be a theme going out through this whole entire build. Obviously gold and ebony is going to be your main primary thing for resources. So let's create the boots, the gauntlets and the helmet to finish it all off as well. And I have increased my smithing ranks. Believe it or not, yes I know, I should be a stupidly more higher than this. But I am currently not at this current point in time. <laughs> Something to work out for future videos. Okay, so the shattered army. Hopefully the game doesn't freeze or anything. It's so far so good. Hopefully none of it is invisible as well. Okay, so we have got the full set on, and I'm super psyched here. Oh, I'm done. I'm done. D that on its own looks freaking damn beautiful. I don't even need to rotate. Here we go. We're going to rotate. Oh, my God. It looks absolutely insane. What the hell? No way. That looks amazing. I feel a lot taller as well. Why is the camera zoomed in so much? That is just beautiful in every single way. Wow. I think that's actually better than the in-game textures of Black Desert Online, if I'm perfectly honest. That looks absolutely amazing. That is a super sick set of armor. Oh my god. I cannot believe that. Look at... Now the thing is, why I get so excited about these mods is not just because of the fact of that they work or they look cool. I just really appreciate all of the detailing and all the amount of time taking over to pour it and everything else. I know some of people that have spent a lot of time creating certain mods and they're not that great. So when people make absolutely amazing mods, I know for a fact they've taken a super amount of long time to pour over, create, mesh, sort out all the different textures as well. But this one in general just looks absolutely amazing. Look how beautiful it is. Obviously from head to toe in white and gold, looking down beautiful and sexy. Um, I love the headgear back with the shoulders as well. And it doesn't seem to be any clipping at all. Like none at all. I love how as well the head sort of flows away from the... You're going to get really dizzy, I do apologise. I'm just staring at the neck and the top of the helm there. None of it clips. None of it is all stuck together. 
it's just freaking it's beautiful it's a beautiful set of armor and there's a shame that nothing obviously complements it with sort of weaponry so far but i'm pretty sure there is something out there and if there is let me know in the comment section below let me know if you're going to grab this mod as well uh, i think it's absolutely beautiful obviously you can make this in the forge in the daedric section very easy but it is kind of pricey but you are getting an absolutely amazing set of armor armor value is great it looks fucking sexy as hell and just generally overall just an amazing piece of gear guys thanks for sticking by and watching these videos i really do appreciate it subscribe if you're new as well because we do pump out daily content on the channel i really do enjoy sort of showcasing these mods let me know if you have anything in particular you want me to have a look at but until the next one guys get a care for it and get a get out